Okay, this is video two of the gopher trap. And you can see from here, I have two gophers in there. Um, I caught three the other day and I transferred them into a cage. And I think this looks like a big one. So we'll get closer here and see what we have. And they're not very happy, I'm kind of scared. So, let's see what we have in here. Hey, babies. Hey, babies. It's okay. Yeah. Let's see what we've got in here. Yeah. Hi, guys. Guys. Oh. What have we got? Oh, it looks like we have the two adults. Nope. A young one. A juvenile and an adult. Good. We can get them transferred in with the other ones. And then I can let them all go into a new place together. Okay. Good deal. All right. Now I'll pause this and go. Well, you probably won't be able to see the babies that I got because they are going to be hiding inside their house. But we'll go look. Okay, so inside of the chicken yard is a box with a cage in it. The cat litter box on the far end of that, which we'll get closer in a little bit, that's where they hide inside there. And then they have the cage they can go in and out of. Um, most of the time they spend hiding. You may have heard me. But I'll go in and get closer. Okay, so here we're up close. Here's the tidy cat box. And there's a um, PVC pipe that connects the box to the cage. And inside the box, there are three critters. I don't know if I can get a view of them. I don't want them to jump out, so I'll have to be very careful. Let's see. Sorry. Put my hand in front of the camera. Just a quick little peek in there. Let's see if we can see anybody. There we go. Whoops. There we go. See the one? There they are. Okay. So they're in there. We'll put these rocks back up. Make sure that they don't um, can't push that lid up. And then the other um, pipe there, this box had two holes in it for transferring. Um, okay, so I gotta make another drip box like that tidy cat box for the new ones to transfer into another tidy cat box out of the big cage. 